Our next video will be on number formatter and how you can format a number. Formatting a number is very simple. All you can do is you can just give it a specific number and then you can specify what type of grouping do you want on the number. Whether you want to have a comma grouping or whether you want to have a space grouping. And it is very simple. All you have to do is just click on save and send a test request and you can see how it works. So comma grouping work on a multiple say of thousands. And as you can see what it did is it added a comma on every thousands uh, separations. Next is the space grouping. What it does is it adds a space in the number and you can see it added a space in a number like this. Similarly, if you increase the number by one extra zero, this is how the entire grouping will be. All groupings will be in the segments of thousands. So you can see this is how the number will be grouped. Uh, one more thing, right now we are adding a static value in the number section. If you have a value which is coming up from a space from a trigger step above, for example, you can see the webhook response is giving us a currency which happens to be thousand. What you can do is you can also map the number right here. So you can just map the number which is coming from webhook currency is thousand and then you can just click on save and send a test request and the mapped value will actually be shown right here in the number formatter itself. So I hope this video will be useful for you to format a number with the use of format number module. Thank you.